Hey guys, it's your boy Fiskon here with a video on bounty hunting in Star Citizen 3.8.2. And this is really just the basics. And the first thing we need to know how to do is how to unlock access to these player bounties. And it's pretty simple actually. You just gotta do two initial bounty missions, which you can access via the F1 Moby Glass menu, heading to Contracts, down to Bounty Hunter. Your first mission will be Bounty Collection Authorization Assessment, and then your second one is the Pro Tem Bounty Contract. These are easy, you don't really need anything crazy to do this, just go out there in your regular ship and kick some ass. After you do these initial bounty missions, you'll be able to obtain the player bounties. And just the way you did it before, you enter your Moby Glass with F1, head to Contracts, and then open up the Bounty Hunter tab. And you'll notice that missions with the prefix bounty assignment, as you see here, the CS4 and the CS3, are NPC bounties. Missions with the prefix bounty issued player name, in this case bounty issued commander halftail, are going to be your player bounties. And in this case they generally issue out 10k plus payments. Now, regarding tactics, I would not recommend player bounties for purely financial reasons. You know, the variables involved are not good for your income. Unless, of course, like, you find a rogue crew out there or a carrick that went nuts and decided to kill everyone. And that would be nice, because then you'd probably get, like, 40 to 50k if you kill the ship. But, I mean, I, I don't know how likely that is. I can say I've never seen one. Uh, the second is, real simple, ask them. Be like, yo, you got a bounty. You want me to fix that for you? It'll be real easy. Just hop on board. I kill you. And then we call it good. Yeah. More often than not, this works. You know, not everybody wants to be a rogue criminal. Some people, it actually happens on accident. But uh, not everyone's going to be like that. And so lastly, make sure you use your IR suppression to sneak up on your targets. And I'll show you how to do that real quick. You just got to go access your heat menu. So you go to menu on your ship, heat, and suppress overall IR. Now you can look up some, some videos to show you why you want to do that. Um, the saver does it best. I think you can get detection down to like 1800 meters, which is insane. You can just sneak up on your target. It's easy pickings. It just depends on how well you can dogfight. But uh, the last tip I would give you is to enjoy the hunt, my boys. Have fun. Kick some ass. And I hope you have some great bounty hunting, guys. Meet one more time.